Hey guys, this is Faith, and today I'm here with... Casey, Casey Brothers Delicious, what's up everybody? Yes. Hi. That's it. <laughs> Thai food, it's all of our first time eating Thai food. Not mine though. Mm. Ooh, yeah. Um, <laughs> Don't try the dumpling, just try the, the noodles. I like it. Oh no. So, yeah, we're gonna film a video. All of his social medias will be linked down below. Go follow him. He's very nice and very great, but yeah. <laughs> Tell you that I love you 100 times a day You'll get tired of my voice That's how much So we are here And we have to walk to the market Because we parked so far away But yeah, let's go I'm gonna let everyone know About my love So I really hope you love me It's very cool here in Seattle. Wasn't there for a long time though, but they have a lot of choirs. Whoa, there's a lot of rain over there that just splattered on me. Oh, there's something. Hey guys, this is Faith and I'm here with Nikki Suyama and Russell Brooks. And they are here with me because they work with the Red Eagle Soaring and um, would you like to explain what you do? Sure, so I am the program manager for Red Eagle Soaring Native Youth Theater Program. We serve Native youth ages 10 to 19 and do year-round programming with anything performance arts based. We are a theater program, but we do film, we do song, traditional and contemporary, um, and we do pretty much anything, even like um, art, like actual physical art. You know, we, we have a lot of kids that like to do painting and drawing and all that, so we provide a space for everyone to express themselves with confidence and clarity through traditional and contemporary arts. <laughs> uh, I'm Russell Brooks. I'm the executive director for Red Eagle Soaring, so I take care of all the oversight and the day-to-day -day operations um, and uh, also oversee our um, uh, 
like our programming uh, related content that Nikki's in charge of and then also development where we connect with funders and donors that help support uh, Red Eagle Soaring. Um, Red Eagle Soaring is one of the only native uh, youth theaters in the United States uh, that, that I know of. Um, but uh, we also have an alumni program which Nikki's a part of and uh, one of our other performers who is out here today uh, called YTT which is Yesterday, Today and Tomorrow Urban Native Performing Artists and that's our youth that uh, into their adulthood continue uh, having careers in the arts whether it's singing whether it's acting um, filmmaking playwrights uh, comedians uh, we've we've got a, a whole uh, smorgasbord as they say of uh, different uh, artists and they come back and mentor our youth as well all right that's really awesome they are located here in Seattle but um yeah thank you guys for your time yeah, thanks babe. thank you thank you <laughs> Okay, so now we are going to go check out the Red Eagle Soaring Office. We're in the building. We are in the building. This is the... Pretty cool. Yeah. Uh, Red Eagle Soaring shirt for you. Really? Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> I got a shirt, guys. <laughs> yeah, you're welcome. I'm glad to get to finally meet you. Yeah, me too. This is awesome. Yeah. Tiny doorknob. Is it a pull or push? I don't know how to open the door. <laughs> okay. Yeah, let's go in this store. We're gonna go in the vintage clothing store. Hello. Ooh. So this vintage store is really cool. I was looking at that purse, but I don't know if it's for sale. But um, no, we're gonna walk back to the car. Dunk champion, we are here, Seattle, Washington, at Lucky Dog. Come show some love. 